Hi, I'm Andy, the trend follower, and welcome to this week's review of the different asset classes. It's Friday, the 19th of April, 2019. So the markets are closed today because it's Good Friday and it's a bank holiday, of course, so I can do this video slightly earlier than normal. Now, I don't know which asset class is gonna do best, so I follow all of them. Shares, property, gold, commodities, and bonds. Now, I'm gonna look at shares first of all and see how they're doing. Now I'm fully invested and the, uh, that's because the price of this investment had risen up and closed up above the green line uh, a few weeks ago. So uh, I invested, the price hasn't changed very much since then, the past couple of weeks it's changed uh, not much at all. So I'm staying invested in this fund. Okay, let's look at property next. And I'm in cash here. Uh, it's risen a little bit in price this week, but it's still below the green line, so not uh, enough movement to trigger uh, a buy signal just yet. I haven't been invested in this fund since the autumn of last year, so uh, I'm having to be very patient here. I'm staying in cash. Right, let's look at gold, and the gold price dropped uh, this week. You can see where I invested, it went up, uh, and it's kind of going down at the moment, but it's still above the green line, so I'm staying invested in gold. Right, commodities, oh dear, yes. Uh, commodities. I'm in cash here because the price of this fund dropped and closed below the green line and I exited and I'm just kind of waiting for things to happen. It's well below the green line but it's rising uh, and I'm staying cash for the time being but I'm sure I'll get a buy signal soon. Bonds I don't trade in and out of, I just remain invested. Uh, I have bond investments in three different currencies, uh, British pounds, euros and US dollars. I just hold them, uh, I don't trade them. Uh, it's easier that way and it hedges my currency a bit. Okay, here are the traffic light signals for each asset class this week. Shares are on a green, property is a red still, gold is a green, commodities are a red and bonds for me are always uh, a green. So what do I have to do this week? Well, nothing at all, which is nice and simple, but not always easy, as I've said before. Right, if you want to get a weekly update, make sure you're on my mailing list. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor. Uh, this video is just about what I do. Uh, it's not advice from me to you. And if you copy me, you do it at your own risk. So I hope you uh, have a great week and I'll do another video for you next weekend. Thanks for watching and have a happy Easter. Bye for now.